16. 16 returning Pokemon have been confirmed for Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield in this brand new nostalgic trailer. What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred and today I'm just going to do a quick rundown of the 16 new Pokemon that got revealed today in this brand new dope ass looking trailer. Let's jump right into it. Now the article I'm getting my information from this list from is from loopots.com. I'm going to have a link to their article in the description below. They also get their sources from CeraV.net, who I'm also going to have in the description below. And then they have the 16 brand new Pokemon that are appearing in this brand new trailer for the first time that we're knowing that they're going to be in Pokemon Sword and Shield. There was a lot of like confusion about this trailer earlier when it, the trailer launched and a lot of people were saying, why would they show these Pokemon if, you know, we don't got the national decks inside of Pokemon Sword and Shield? Why would they tease these Pokemon and they, these Pokemon not be in the game? That doesn't make any sense. What what makes more sense is that all of these Pokemon will be in the game. So we're considering that these Pokemon will be. That's why Joe Merrick from Cerebi and other big name sites that probably have the game are reporting that these are going to be in the game. Now on this list, I have there's a couple of Pokemon. I do know a couple of them that I have to look up to fucking like actually know like what the fuck it's got. But just to go over the list real quickly, and I'm probably going to mess up a ton of these names. We got Shuckle, we got Rembrandt. We got Artillery, C Dot, Nuzleaf, Surefire, Torquil, the guy I don't know, Gorpy, Dampin, Muna, Mashard, Shraggy, uh, <laughs> Scarfred, and Dirt. I know who that is. Bisha, Bisha made it, and Pimpicue. Now, again, if you haven't seen the trailer, I'm going to have a link to the full trailer below just so you can dive into the nostalgia factor. But I think this is pretty cool. The, for one, the way they revealed these Pokemon being in the game. Two, the trailer is so dope. I wish I did a trailer reaction review on it, but I seen the trailer before I even known this was a thing that we're going to get brand new Pokemon revealed in it. As Not even brand new Pokemon, but returning Pokemon revealed in it and stuff like that. I was going to do a trailer reaction review like I said but again I, I once I seen the trailer I don't you know I wouldn't want to record a fake reaction or anything like that so I just wanted to get this information out there because we do see brand new Pokemon for the first time inside a Pokemon Sword and Shield granted we, we you know we're getting the artwork from these past generations you would think that these new sprites at the end of the trailer is representing them for Pokemon Sword and Shield, but that's kind of, um, we can't determine that yet because this is the first time we've seen some of these, but comparing on how Charizard looks and Beware and the Pokemon we have seen, it does very similarly look like this is an engine inside of the Pokemon Sword and Shield games. Granted, the real people standing, you know, in a real field and the real parts of the world, you know, take that part out of it, but the sprites of the Pokemon does look one-to-one -to, -one to what we see in the Pokemon Sword and Shield game. So they all look incredible and I can't wait to get my hands on these games. Let me know in the comment section below your thoughts of one, this brand new trailer and two, the 16 Pokemon that, that made it. Which one is your favorite? I'm going to have to go for my Gen 3 guys that we've seen for the first time. But then also, you know, Bisharp being in the game is, is of course, you know what I'm saying? It's like, I'm like, yes, is this one of those dope looking Pokemon that you would want to see in this brand new iteration of Pokemon inside? of Pokemon Sword and Shield, but let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Which of these 16 Pokemon is your favorite that you are happy to see return inside of the Pokemon Sword and Shield games? As you guys know, this is a conversation. I answer all comments, so let's chat it down in the comment section below. If you are new around here, hit that subscribe button. I do videos like this daily. I've been sick the past couple of days, and I'm in the process of moving, which kind of sucks right now as far as getting content done and stuff like that but you guys know the grind i'm trying to post a video at least once a day and if not i'm posting multiple a day bro so again hit that subscribe button if you want to check out the videos ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time i drop a video hit the like button it helps me out a ton 
as far as boosting the channel and getting it into recommended so other people can check out the video and like the video as well. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next one. Like always, guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on Instagram and Twitter, and you guys can bring the conversation there. I'm the American Gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube, and yes, I'm going to be doing a ton of videos just like this one. So if you enjoy, please hit that subscribe button. Also, hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned. Ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time I drop a video. Peace. I'm going to see you guys on the next one.